Lil Mosey just dropped his new single, Jumping Out The Face. The beat for this song is made out of a simple catchy bell pattern that repeats throughout the track. I have been trying to figure out what makes this beat so catchy for the past week and well, I think I figured it out. So today I'll show you how to make a beat like Jumping Out The Face by Lil Mosey. With that said, let's begin. As always, I'll break this beat down into three parts, the melody, the drums, and the arrangement that affects. So let's start with the melody. The melody on this track is basically a simple catchy bell with a flute counter melody. Counter to what you would assume, making a simple catchy melody is a lot harder than making a complex piano pattern in my opinion. That's mainly because when it comes to a complex pattern, there's a lot of tricks you can use, like the ones in my last video on the Kid Leroy tragic beat. But in simple catchy beats, you can't because there simply isn't enough space for that. I mean, look at this. This is the bell pattern for Lil Mosey's song. It has four notes and it's literally one bar long. So how do you make a simple catchy beat? Well, this is what I found. First, the notes. This pattern may seem just random notes that for some reason sound good, but no, there's actually some basic music theory in here. If you take the notes on this melody and rearrange them as a chord, you'll see that this melody is all happening inside of a minor 7th chord. So to recreate this first, I'll choose a minor 7th chord. Now that you know which notes to use, let's talk about timing. If you look at jumping out the faces pattern, you'll see that there are two main positions, either right on beat or in the middle. Also, you'll realize that these bells kind of go up and then back down. And lastly, then the melody doesn't start right away, but it starts half a beat late. So let's try to recreate that. Now the counter. Besides from the bell, jumping out the face also has a flute pattern counter melody that comes and goes throughout the beat. I don't want to copy that exactly, so I'll just add this synth lead. And that's pretty much it for the melody, let's move on to the drums. The drums on this beat have five main elements, the clap, hi-hat, a thumpy kick, a short 808, and a perk. The clap is pretty simple, just put it here. Also add a hi-hat on every step and add rolls around the end of every bar. Add the kick like this. Add the bass note from the melody to the 808 and add a perk around the middle of every beat. And that's it for the drums, now let's go over arrangement and effects. Jumping out the face has five main stages. First, it starts with the drums right away and the melody has a halftime effect on it. Then the actual melody and the drums come in. Then comes a bell melody without the halftime effect and the drums. Then it adds this one beat repeat of the last part of the pattern before the drop. Kind of like Pharrell does it in some of his songs. Then it includes a second version of the melody pitched up one octave. And lastly, it's just the melody. So here's what all that sounds like. And yeah, that's how to make a beat like Jumping Out The Face by Lil Mosey. If you want to download the melody shown in this video, there's a free download link in the description. And as always, see ya.